Now, your WLKY weather with meteorologist Daniel Johnson. Are you telling me I need to take a trip to San Francisco to get my snow fix in? Just incredible seeing the snow out there. While here across the Ohio Valley, we are in a bit of a snow drought. Below average snow, we really haven't had much in the way of any measurable snow since late December. All right, let's see what's happening out the door right now. A live look, downtown Louisville, a quiet night. A bit on the chilly side, 46 degrees with partly cloudy to mostly cloudy skies. Uh, that wind is right out of the southwest at 6, so that is a mild wind. So we're not expecting it to get as cold tonight as what it was last night. However, last night wasn't even that cold, 38. Some of us will get into the 30s tonight, some of us already there. Here in the city, probably hovering right around 40 degrees. 57 was that high today, so it turned out to be a nice afternoon. Here's a look at those current temperatures. Colder outside of the city, 38 in Corridon. Salem already down to 36, North Vernon 35, 40 in Taylorsville. Uh, wind speeds, as I mentioned, coming out of the southwest, the winds are light, right around 5 miles per hour. But get ready. Hold on to your hats, especially on Monday. Let's talk about the gusts that we're expecting. Tonight, tomorrow, light winds, not a problem at all. But here we go into Monday. A strong system pushes in. These are future wind gusts by noon on Monday. This is 55 miles per hour here in Louisville, 56 miles per hour, 57 in Salem and Scottsburg. So a lot of us will be gusting between 50 and 60 miles per hour through the day Monday. That can cause some problems and it can cause some power outages. So we're going to watch that as we head through tomorrow. And it's Monday where we get into those strong winds. Tonight, just a few clouds pushing in, and those clouds should thicken up as we head into your Sunday. You can see more clouds out to the west heading in our direction. So increased clouds likely heading into late tonight and into your Sunday. Overall, partly cloudy tonight down to near 40 degrees. Tomorrow, look at this. Clouds are increasing, but it's another mild day. Warmer than today. We're going to go with 60 for that afternoon forecast high. Futurecast tells the story here in terms of clouds increasing tomorrow and also precipitation chances Monday. Not only will we be dealing with wind gusts on Monday, we're going to be dealing with some rain and maybe even some thunderstorms. Here we go into tonight, clouds pushing in, but they really push in through the day Sunday. I'm still expecting some sunshine on Sunday, a partly sunny sky, but then becoming mostly cloudy by dinner time. Rain free on Sunday, so we're good. But then here we go, Sunday night, some showers push in, but it's Monday morning, 8 in the morning. Look at this. We have some storms popping up across the area. There could be a line of storms that develop and push through, and that's going to really enhance those strong wind gusts. The good news about Monday is we clear out for the afternoon and temperatures climb into the 70s. But this is the bad news. Storm Prediction Center has put a good chunk of our area. Louisville points to the east under a slight risk for some severe thunderstorms. So we're gonna keep an eye out on that forecast for you. But look at that nice Monday afternoon. Yes, windy, but 72. And the thing about Monday is even if your neighborhood does not get a thunderstorm, you're still gonna get very strong wind gusts. Tuesday looks great, 61. Ooh, Wednesday, 74, with a mix of sun and clouds. And what is that on Friday? Rain and or snow? 45, what's happening, Jerk? I really don't know anymore. Well, why am I asking you? <laughs> it's just... I'm supposed to know what's going on. It's wacky weather for sure. No doubt. And I it's mean, March. seeing California, what they're having compared mm -hmm. to what we're having, it's just everything's upside down. It's just outside L.A., San Francisco, getting snow. All right. Buckle up. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Daniel.